Hi guys, Robert here at Max Guitar. I have something very special to show you. Uh, during a visit uh, to the Martin uh, Custom Shop um, last year, we saw this guitar. Um, it's called a Sailor Jerry guitar, and it's an homage to a guy, Norman Collins, who was actually nicknamed Sailor Jerry, who was a very famous tattoo artist, and he came up with this style that you know. It's an iconic tattoo style. Uh, You've seen boats, anchors, hearts uh, with a lot of color. He was actually the first tattoo artist who used colors like purple, yellow, and all uh, red, of course. Um, and he came up with, this, uh, with these iconic designs. So the Martin Custom Shop made uh, uh, this guitar in a very limited run. Uh, there is actually a Martin magazine that tells you, uh, I think in a 10 page spread, all about how this was made and why it was made. So anyone who would like um, to read that, we can send you a copy actually. So leave your name and address or send us a personal message. So of course at the Martin Custom Shop, they use the best tone woods like uh, East Indian Rosewood, uh, Koa inlays, as you can see here. They use uh, Bubinga, they use Paduk. Uh, this is a bear claw spruce top. Um, a very nice rosewood fingerboard and mahogany uh, neck. So this is all, all fine and well because you know that from Martin Custom Shop it's the best quality around. But what they did with the inlays is actually new and very special. Of course they use shell like uh, Mother of Pearl as you can see and Pawa here in the, in the headstock. Uh, and also the, the intricate inlays on the neck are very special with the, all kinds of material. But what they did with the, with the wood inlay, because these are all small pieces of wood, they used hot sand, so they heated sand in a sort of a pan. And if you dip a piece of wood, small piece of wood, into this sand, so the lower you get or the deeper you get, the hotter the sand is and the darker the wood becomes. So you get this sort of a, a gradient. It's very nicely done. It's really, really a work of art, as you can see. Some may hate it but I absolutely love it. If you see, uh, there is nothing uh, left to chance on this guitar. It's amazing and there are very few made. So if you're interested, Sasha is gonna demonstrate this guitar in another video, but if you're interested, let me know and uh, I'll send you a copy of this magazine because that's really nice. See you at Max Guitar.